Your actions here have only delayed the inevitable. Slowing these savages will have only angered them. They will see this as a betrayal and launch a full-scale assault. They will not reach my land. The war will hold them back. Your land? You think your successes matter? China is just a piece of the prize. We will rule the world. And the box you so kindly presented us will be yet another tool to achieve a time of peace. Peace? You think you're a hero now? I don't want your world, your control. Give me the box, and your death will be fast. Your box is lost, assassin. Already out of China, in the safe hands of my fellow Templars. Then another assassin will find the box. That will be their destiny. Mine lies here with you. This is the end, Zhang Yong. There is nowhere to run to.
A little distraction could help me here. Here I come, Zhang Yong. Assassin, is it as you'd hoped? Do not flatter yourself, Sang Yong. You had to die for China to have hope again. I started this journey for vengeance, but I've understood now that it's pointless. I have found a better goal to pursue. And what is that? The future. A new tomorrow for China and its people. I will undo all that you have done. I will rebuild the Brotherhood and recruit those who wish to make our land a place of freedom. Those ready to die to fight men like you. Your Templar world will not happen. The Assassins will rise again. Mentor. The Emperor is dead. The Elixir of Life? Yes. It killed him, as you had planned. His son will follow in his footsteps. The war will protect the people now, and so shall we. Mentor. Last time we talked, you were telling me about Master Auditor's precursor box. Ah. Ezio's great gift to me. Yes. I never discovered what the box could do. Yet the artifact, and my obsession with it, taught me a great lesson. Perhaps the greatest of lessons. What was that, Mentor? She who seeks revenge should remember to dig two graves. 